We're here outside one of my favourite spots in County Loud, Fitzpatrick's. It goes back years. It reminds me of trips on the way home from Cardiff. I said we'll pop in for one, and you might miss shouldn't be behind the wheel. But anyway, we won't go there. Uh, we're, we're here with uh, Chef Cotter and Potty is the GM. Correct, yeah. And uh, guys, great to be back here and it's great to see it open. Absolutely. You great had, to see you it. had a, like everybody else, a, a it was a long 14 weeks, yeah. 14, 14, 14 weeks. You weren't full, closed the full yeah, time? Yeah, we were closed the whole time. We didn't do the takeaways as such. Okay. We just concentrated on getting the property ready for reopening, getting our table spaced out. Uh, Connor concentrated on getting the menu sort of for reopening. Uh, and then, as I say, you, you've seen it yourself in the restaurant. We've uh, distance tables out. We've power specs up at reception along our bar area. Yeah. We've hand sanitising units all around the place, and a lot of it is just common sense then as well. And it's down to the punter as well to yeah. look after themselves. We're all big boys and girls. That's it. Yeah, correct Simple and right. That. And we're here to taste uh, chicken wings and. These chicken wings have been sort of, you think you've got the best in County Loud. I absolutely do. <laughs> <laughs> we go through that much of them. Honest to goodness. And where do you yeah. get them? Uh, we get them locally. Okay. Uh, delivered, delivered every day. Magic. Sure a large amount of them. Do you know, we were in a couple of places and the amount of places that, that sell kilo upon kilo upon kilo of wings. It's, yeah. It's, it's uh, I bet they haven't said ton. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, you, you boys dealing tons here. There on Saturday we went through 80 kilo a wing. Dear God. Yeah. So Dear God. That was just and one day. What about then, since uh, like I, I know I've been in your kitchen, it's a really busy spot, or was before COVID. How is it now? Uh, it's actually, surprisingly, it's actually pretty busy still. Okay. Um, we're still doing good numbers where we are. Not, not the same numbers that we were doing, but with the social distancing, we're, we're doing pretty well. In my opinion, I think over the first couple of weeks, people were a little bit standoffish. Yeah, they were. They quite were quite standoffish. There were some people uh, very, I'd say, nervous about coming back in, yeah. especially the, the older generation. We were quite nervous. We would have had a very busy trade here lunchtime with an older generation. Yeah. We just haven't seen as many faces back as we would have liked. Mm -hmm. But thankfully, at the same time, the weather's good. A lot of people are still out. Yeah. We're still busy, thank God. What about outdoor dining? Are you we're, doing, like we're doing outdoor dining, yeah. No, obviously it's weather permitting. Yeah. There was a case here on Saturday where there was people sitting outside in just typical Irish weather. Yeah. It started raining. Yeah. yeah so absolutely. trying to get them seated and get them places. But so far, I think we're just ahead of, ahead of where we thought we would be at this stage. Our local community here is unbelievable. Mm -hmm. Only for our local community here, we would I would actually say we would be no without them. Yeah. It's unbelievable. Even the support we've had on social media, people have been messaging us, ringing us in, listen, we'll get back to you as soon as you get opened and stuff like that. There, Our local trade has been spectacular, but then we do have an awful lot of trade that travels. We have a couple who travels here once, maybe twice a week from Ashburn, religiously. Really? That's fantastic. And so what's so special about your chicken wings? Final question, Jeff. What's so special about them? It will have to be the freshness of them and the sauce mm -hmm. that's coated in them. So tell me what you, how do you make the sauce again? Oh, well, that's a secret point. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, Chef, thank you very much. Marty, you're a gentleman. Thanks thank you very much, We're going to have a little taste now. No and we'll see, it's our second last call here in County Loud. So we're really looking forward to having a little taste. I don't know, my chicken winged out? Never. Okay, um, I was saving the best to last each time, so this time we're going to take the best first. Tori, yeah. mm -hmm. here we go. You're, you're just uh, smiling and smiling as you eat those chicken wings. Do you yeah. like them? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I do. Oh, I do. I do. I do. I do. <laughs> A lot. Mm. Spice levels. Lovely. Aren't they? Mm. They're not too... Are, what, what do you think about sort of the, um, the meat content? The meat's lovely. They complement they complement each other with the spice and the tenderness and everything. That's right. They are really good, aren't they? Mm. They've been cooking chicken wings a long time here in Fitzpatrick's now, Definitely. so they, they should know what they're doing. Mm. And uh, there's Chef. Look at Chef with his uh, greasy fingers. Uh, Mouthful. This must say something. Great presentation. Uh-huh. Uh, nice to get enough celery or crudite uh -huh. to dip in the uh, sauce. The wings are very good. The spice, for me, just about right. Mm -hmm. The amount of chicken, the meat is excellent. The 
wings are cut, they're grated, and they're hot. Yeah. I mean, as it, in temperature hot. Yeah, yeah. As well as being spicy hot. Mm -hmm. They're very, very good. Very, very well produced product. Mm -hmm. Very, very good. What do you think of the spice level? Is it, is it a good spice level? For me, fine. I wouldn't expect if it was any hotter, you're getting into a specialised oh, yeah. wing type. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the guy who wants to lose the enamel off his teeth. Yeah. You know, so <laughs> we're not into that. But this spice is good. It's just give me a little bit of beating. Yeah. <laughs> a little bit of beating, but not overly hot. There's a good background. Okay. Good, good chili background to it. Fantastic. It's a very well, a very well made American style butter hot sauce. And there's something else that's really fantastic. The chips. The, chip, the chips are excellent as well. The right? chips are like uh, sort of uh, proper home cut. Really, really triple cooked, etc. Justin, I agree with everything Jack says. Yeah, really, really good way. Really good way. I would like it slightly more spicy and a little bit more vinegary. I like that vinegary kick. That's okay. Like, but, you know, really well, you know, it's going to be a tad crispier, but really good meat, really good sauce. The blue cheese is fantastic. That's blue gone as well. You like your blue yeah. cheese. We all know that by now. Yeah. <laughs> those, those are a great way. Well, they have been. Fantastic. And I haven't looked around and changed them since. So they're great. So there you go. From the horse's mouth. They, it does exactly what it says in the tin. They're hot, they're spicy, they're chicken wings. And that was, that was us and Fitzpatrick. So sadly, we're coming to the end of our journey, but we've one more to go. The guy who'd laid down the gauntlet in the first place. We're going to the bay tree to Connor Woods. Connor says as he means, and he means he's got the best chicken wing. Our guys are going to tell him if he has or not. See you in the bay tree. <laughs>